The concept of in my control and out of my control items in strategic management doesn't fall under a single specific area. It's a fundamental principle that applies across the entire strategic management process. Here's a breakdown of how it applies in different stages. 1. Strategic analysis. When conducting an internal and external analysis, you're essentially separating in control and out of control factors. Analyzing your strengths and weaknesses falls under in your control, while understanding the competitive landscape, market trends, and regulations falls under out of control. 2. Strategy formulation. When choosing your strategic direction, you consider both sets of factors. You leverage your internal strengths and resources in control to exploit opportunities or mitigate threats out of control in the external environment. 3. Strategy implementation. As you execute your strategy, you focus on controlling the controllable factors like resource allocation, project management, and team performance. However, you also need to be prepared to adapt to changing external factors outside your control. 4. Strategy evaluation and control. When monitoring and evaluating your progress, you assess how well you've controlled the internal factors and how effectively you've adapted to external influences. Therefore, understanding in my control and out of control items is not limited to a specific area but acts as a guiding framework for the entire strategic management process.